let's pretend we're on the islands and make us some mojo moho ribs. We're going to make us some marinade. Start out with a handful of cilantro, stems and all, eight cloves of garlic, zest of one lemon, one jalapeno, seeds and all, two cups of freshly squeezed orange juice, and three quarters cup of freshly squeezed lime juice. Then we're just going to blend this baby up. Pull out the old Nutribullet, whatever blender you have. Make her nice. Now we're going to use some St. Louis cut ribs. I'm not going to do much trimming to these. Okay, I'm not doing any trimming to these. We're just going to flop them over and pull the membrane. You can use a knife, a fork, or however you've learned from other YouTube people. And do it or you can just get you a napkin, find you a loose piece of that membrane and pull. In case you missed it, we'll do it one more time. Ooh, farmer's tan. That wouldn't look good on the island. Alrighty, and there you have it. Nothing fancy. Just straight out the pack ribs. So let's get these things marinating. I'm going to use a mm, vacuum seal. I don't have any little fancy uh, filters to keep it from sucking up any machine. So I'm probably going to make a mess here. Just dump it in. Stick in your vacuum seal. And I'm going to hang it over the side. Maybe I won't make too much of a mess. Vacuum her up. And, okay, I sucked a lot of it up in there. But I got it sealed. Get you a little help. And uh, let's tape it down. That way we get the marinade all over these ribs. That way we don't have to get up in the middle of the night and flip them. Because what we're going to have to do, let them soak overnight in the fridge. And there we have it. New shirt and all. Now let's get these babies out. Cut them open. Pull them out. We're not going to worry about washing them off. All that green stuff you see there is flavor. It may not be the prettiest ribs yet, but we're going to work on that. Okay, get the rub, brother. Come on. Oh, you got to flip them over. Hey, these things were tender enough to eat right now, but I figure they're a little raw. We're going to start. We're going to give them a good dose of Mojo Barbecue. Hey, it wouldn't be a Mojo channel if I didn't use Mojo. And uh, just a good one. We're going to let it set. Since y'all wanted to see my face, here you go. Let's put them on the grill. We're going to be cooking on the pellet today. Hadn't cooked on the pellet on the tube before, so let's fire up. We're going to let her run at 225. Get some of that good smoke. And when I close this lid, I'm not going to worry about these ribs for five and a half hours. No peeking, no spritzing, no nothing. We're just going to let her roll. And... Five and a half hours later, here you have it. I think they look great. So I'm checking for tenderness here. As long as we went, we could have pulled them at 196. But 200, that's a good safe number to have tender ribs. And we're going to get them off without breaking them. Let me give you another elbow shot. There you go. Let's get them on the cutting board. Here you have it. Hey. I said hey again. I like to say hey a lot. They got a good color. I can't wait to taste them. Oh, but, whew, man, they must be hot. Let's get one of these out of the way and get the slicing. I'm ready to taste these babies. And while I'm sitting here cutting these up, if you stop by to see this video, much love. Now, we appreciate it. Uh, wouldn't do this without y'all. Now we got them flipped over, pushed together. I think it's time for a bite. I've waited long enough. And I got a typical mojo. I gotta take my time. I don't know what my deal is. So let's get this thing ate. Hey, moisture is phenomenal. Uh, got that bite. The tenderness is there. You looking for that comp style bite? We got it. I think I'm gonna go back for another one on this one. Let me tell you what, I've cooked a lot of ribs, and this has to be one of my favorite ribs of all times. The wife seems to agree. These are going to be on our menu a lot more. We got that bone out just to prove to you that we got the tenderness. And if it even if it matters, look, 
It gets the shake test, the point test. You got to try these guys. Come on. Give them a shot. Let me know what you think. I'm going to finish this up. And I'm out of here. Hey, y'all have a great one.